And tell us again how big this house will be. It's approximately 6,500 square feet. Not too it's small. It's all one story. Yeah, I noticed that. High ceilings. Right. Yes, very high ceilings. All the ceilings are 10 foot at the plate height in two of the rooms, the great room, family room, and also the master bedroom have higher beam ceilings so that they, they go up to 15 feet. And again, off to the left, which is just starting framing, there are three turret areas in the house cool. that we've done. The one that is off to the left right here is in the guest room slash playroom for the kids. Um, in back of the kitchen is the breakfast room turret area, which is the largest of all of them. And the third one is over the jacuzzi tub in the master bathroom, which is off on the right-hand side of the house. Can we walk inside? Yes. Let's go. Watch your head. How many uh, people will be living in 6,500 square feet? Four. Um, the perfect American family. <laughs> Husband who is an attorney, the wife, um, and two children, one boy, one girl, approaching their teenage years mm -hmm. and will grow into the house that way. Where we're standing now is in the main entry hall which, as you can see, leads directly into the great room, family room, and out into the backyard, pool, tennis court, cabana area. And the ceiling in here is going to be a barrel vaulted ceiling. Oh, wow. If anyone knows what that means, it's going to be like walking into... Yes. Oh, God, that's really cool. Have you ever done that in a house before? Yes, I have. You have. Okay, and then off to your left again, right here in this room, this is the study library. Mm-hmm. Is it going to be like a man cave type study library? No, it's going to be a more formal library with lots of wood built-ins and things like that, a large desk. And that. There's not really a man cave, although there is hmm. a home theater that we will see that. Oh, okay. Okay, we're looking into the bedroom wing right now, and you'll notice that the ceilings here are 10 foot high ceilings. That's the minimum height of any ceiling in the house. All the doors are 8 foot high, and the windows also are at that same height. And behind me is the powder room, which is quite large for a powder room, and like all powder rooms, will turn into a jewel, jewel box at some point. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is the entrance to the master bedroom. It's got a pair of doors leading into it with its own little entry area. This is the master sleeping area. Again, the high ceilings with the beams. Fireplace where? Fireplace is over here, to my right. Right. French doors looking out into the back area and the pool. Okay. And going into the master bathroom. Okay, we're standing in the first of the three turret areas. This is the guest room slash uh, playroom for the children. And there's a bathroom obviously attached to it. But if you look up, you'll see that the turret will be above us. And the windows will include a tall window plus another clear story window above it. 